Welcome to this website tour and this time what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to use the barbecue forum search engine which contains about 340,000 messages that were posted to the early days of the barbecue forum. To do this uh, all you need to do is just click on this link that's located on the barbecue forum barbecue search and once you get to barbecue search you can scroll down past these links to this one main link right here that says barbecue search the barbecue form search engine and if you click on that it's going to take you right to the search engine which looks a little bit like Google eh, well it's like Google in a way but anyway the um, once you're at the search engine you can just type a search string right in here just a, a query or you can um, come down here and you can do what I like to do and that's use the advanced search so if we do if we do a search right here, let's say we do a search on brisket. And we click search. It takes a minute for it to generate the files. And here it is. It found 20,079 messages that were posted to the early years of the barbecue forum about brisket. And the threads are listed like this right here where it says top. That's shows you that that's the first message in the thread and then down below it are the replies to it and so that's one way of using this now the other way that you can use is you can go back to where we were and there's a link right here that says click here for advanced search options now this is the way I like to use a search engine now we can put in that same search we can put in brisket b-r-i-s-k-e-t and, but we can also specify a date range, a starting date, and an ending date. If we want to look for posts about brisket by just one certain author posted by somebody, we can put their name in here, and we can we can do a lot of things. We can uh, we can say where are we going to search both the subject of the the subject and the message, or the subject, or just the message. So we do our searches based upon that criteria, or we can show specify how many how many results we want shown in the results. So we can specify up to a thousand results on the main page when we do the search. So if we do the search on brisket, and we click here from the advanced search, still get the same results. Uh, in this case, because I didn't put any any further restriction on the search, but I just want to show you that you can refine the search to get really good pinpoint results. But anyway, so let's click on this link. And here's the message. And the first message in this was posted by Smokin in, uh, in 1999. And he posts this message. And then there's a couple replies to it, three replies right here and so this tool is really valuable you can go back through the early days of the barbecue forum several you know several thousand messages hundreds of thousands of messages and actually find what you're looking for now if you wanted to what you could do is you could just take and cut and paste this URL which is up there just highlight it and press control C and control V I mean control C and then you could paste this into your optional URL link on the barbecue form you could share this with somebody else and then it could come right to this message that you had found or if you wanted to print this off You'll notice down here at the bottom it says printer friendly version. You can click on that and that printer friendly version will pop up and then you can just click print. And the message starts printing. And this is just some tips on how to use this search engine to really find what you're looking for and to get some good information about barbecue quickly. Anyway, thank you very much. 